Hi, Amanda Lee here in Newcastle, Australia. Just a quick video today about World Peace Day coming up on the 21st of September. I've just dropped the children off at school and I'm just about to go to the gym. And I was thinking about a meeting that I have coming up tomorrow with the Deputy Principal about the commitment that this school here is uh, making to World Peace Day. And what we want to do is have an out-of-uniform um, day for the children. And I suggested that, that they wear white, which would be really nice. And But rather than making it just another day where the children just think, woohoo, we get to wear not wear uniform, and another day that just passes by with a bit of fun activity, I was turning my mind on the weekend to what could we do to make it more of a lasting experience for the children and to start sowing the seed in their mind about what really does make world peace. So rather than sitting around saying, oh yeah, world wars are terrible, oh yes, fighting and suffering's bad and oh, aren't those terrorists awful and that sort of thing, um, rather than, than just looking at the negatives that exist, let's look about at why they do exist and what's going on in people's minds, what's going on in our own minds. And I wanted to get, um, I want to get across the concept to the children that they are not their thoughts. They just have thoughts coming and going. We are not our thoughts and what we need to realise is that we don't need to grasp onto these thoughts. And get across to the children that that's the sort of angle from which world peace really needs to be attacked and we start here attacked that's a good word isn't it <laughs> we start right here with our own children's minds so we're going to do a little meditation on that a little fun uh, mind in a jar meditation and I was also this morning getting another concept across to the my own children actually when they were both fighting over wanting to sit at the same part of the kitchen bench and I was saying to them, well, what's the difference here between you guys fighting over this piece of territory here or some world leaders fighting over some land that ends up leading to millions of people being killed and, and either civil wars or world wars or whatever? What's the difference? We're talking about peace day here and um, and you're doing this. And... I think the concept might have actually got across, at least to, to the ten and a half year old. She moved and the fight was over, so that was a win today anyway. So think about World Peace Day and what your commitment might be, and particularly if you can do something with your school, um, that would be fantastic. So go to the website and get some more information and, and ideas. So it's peaceoneday.com. And World Peace Day is 21st of September. And um, I look forward to catching you next time. There's more info on my web and come over, sorry, not my web, my blog. There's more info on my blog, so come and visit me at amandaleelive.com. Bye.